friends, it's Retro Gaming now, and we're back with Torchlight, and... <laughs> okay, right off the bat, my pet is fleeing. Of course, I was not supposed to get into battle this soon, necessarily. But thankfully, a healthy dose of the late Ember Lance takes care of the problem, except for this guy, who just gets pummeled. Okay, it's a good time to use our upgraded heal spell. Pick up some super health potions. And looks like our golem's gone, so we'll hit number seven. Call him up out of who knows where. And continue going. Yes, another super health potion for sure. Alright, so this will be good. Just clear out this uh this set. Pets fleeing again, so I need to melee this guy. Got him. Alright, so I'm gonna use my number four. Got an unidentified mace here. And Dark Zealot takes a quick shot and dies. So we are moving on for the Blood Disciple. Ooh, another health potion too. Yeah, so I was just thinking, I think in that the last episode we fought a boss right who was really not much to him. I wonder what that was about. Like, was it actually a boss that was supposed to be there? Or do we kind of just stumble upon it like that guy? Okay. Yeah, so uh, as I was going to say, my first move is be getting out of the way. Oh, great. He doesn't resist fire. That's going to be a problem, actually. But let's see. We do have that other one, right? Is this fire? Apparently not. It's doing damage to him. So go ahead and use a potion. And then we're just going to spam this. And four when we My can. My mama is low. Right. I'm just trying to feeling up there too if things really go wrong. But that seemed to work actually. Not a bad strategy. Huh. Alright, let's continue on. Give it to my pet. Take it, pet. I can't believe they can't take shrines. That's like, that's crazy. That's definitely different than fate, of course. I guess it wasn't a shrine, it was a fountain. I suppose if there's something like magical you need to do for the shrine, it would kind of make sense that um, my pet couldn't do it. Regardless, we do have our spell, which is going to be quite effective for us, actually. Uh, snipe him from the balcony. He's dead. And he's fell wings. Get crushed, fell wings. Get crushed. Okay. So we're keeping ahead of the game right now. That's good. We're not getting, not falling behind, not taking unnecessary damage. Except that one, because I was healing. And we're really not having any major issues, I would say. Except we need to get this guy out. But again, like you see, we're not having to face huge swords of enemies, we're just doing slightly smaller groups. It's kind of being split out a little bit. Like that guy, just one of them. And I didn't kill him. I almost killed him. Okay, so my pet seems to want to go down there. Enslaved on the loose. Let's take them all out with one blast. Okay, now that's a little dangerous the healing spell at just the right time, too. Something's going on down there. It's Bloodbreaker. And this elemental. So, yeah, we gotta take out these enemies first. That's usually how we do it. Bloodbreaker's not taking much damage. So I'm gonna take a... Oh, no. Alright, I'm going to the entrance, because we're not gonna lose anything. And we're just going to, uh... run all the way back. That was an unfortunate death. I thought I was doing alright, but I guess not. Even so, it's definitely still a slow floor. Like, I, I'm pretty sure these Black Palace floors are by far the biggest we've seen. Um, at least that I can tell. But, you know, we actually made some decent progress as we're running back. I mean, you know, I could stop the video, but what the heck, it's going to take me, like, less than a minute anyway. So... Keep on going, and we're just about there. There we go. 
Yeah, so that's going to be an issue if I can't hit that from up top. So let's try this. I could just do the potion spam, but like, that's not fun, is it? Okay, so now we're going to go back. Oh no, oh no, I did not want that guy to come after me. Kind of my thinking is that I can like come up here and then aim this downstairs. Yeah, that actually works pretty well. So as long as we have enough mana. Yeah, how about that? Alright, so remember what we were going to do. Strength. And let's get this one a little better too. So we're going to do strength because we have this awesome helmet we're going to put on. Dragon Slayer Aegis. Oh yeah, look at that. I want to see what that looks like. I'm going to go to the menu. Uh, exit the title. Wow, look at that. <laughs> it almost looks like out of place, you know, like... Uh, it reminds me of something from Bioshock, like something you'd see in old deep sea divers. That's kind of what it looks like, that kind of helmet. So I'm not sure if that's quite what I would say, but at least it's pretty good. Got a bunch of bonuses, and... Well, it looks unique, I suppose. I don't know, it's not bad, it's just different. Alright, Torchlight. My pack is full. Okay, so... Keep picking up, up this dumb stuff. I've got a rare item there. Go ahead and use it there. Oh, that was my old weapon. <laughs> right. Okay. Like, eh, I'm not going to worry about it, honestly. Hey, Dragonkin. I don't have anything clever to say. <laughs> His blood disciples are good at. Oh, how should I say? Approach? <laughs> you can just dash right toward me. Man, I got some good mana though. I can really use that for a while without having to stop. Ooh, okay. Heal spell. Fire from a distance. Okay, we could go that bridge, but we're already halfway here, so let's go this way. goes to the same place anyway. What have we got here? Another one of these. Yeah, are these supposed to be the floor bosses? Because, like, I'm not going to lie, they're pretty tough. Like, look at that. Let's see if this works on him, though. It does. So I can somehow deal with the melee damage. I can just hang in there and blast him. Yeah, it's a good spell. I'm glad I got another one. <laughs> Love finishing him out with a melee shot. Maybe uh, one... Oops, too many enemies there. Alright. Ooh. So it looks like, um, no, we still got a few more enemies over here. Alright, so we'll go this way. Ah, there's another boss. The Improbable. Hmm. Okay, so we charge some mana. Boom! See, it's only worse if I'm, like, far away, like, yeah, like this. Extra fast, extra strong. See if I'll have enough mana to take him out this way. It's going to be a slow uh, fight. And we need my pet for support. Do you hear that pet? It's on the loose. Taking damage from something. There we go. Four. Oh, he's fleeing, but he is also dead. Alright, what are we going to dump? Well, we could just use these, and that gives us some space. Perfect. Um, right, I was going to heal up. Oh, enslaved. <laughs> You 
you know what? If we hold back, it's like my golem's gone. So we'll get another golem. Take out this fell wing. Heal our pet again. And then we'll progress. Whew. A swarm in here. Good thing I have a very good uh, weapon for swarms. Right before we got to me, this elemental we can kill with magic. Of course, we need the mana to be able to do that. And so that means it's mace time for a minute. Oh, another one of these. I remember I'm not going to take it. Last time it was just like... It put me like in this... I don't know what. It's like another place, but there's just full of enemies. I don't think it was worth it. It's pretty cool how they do that down the stairs, though. I like that effect. Alright, so our mana is replenished. We are in for a good fight here. Alright, Dragonkin down. Fell wings knocked out of the sky. Elemental, resistant to my attack. Boom. So we'll use our tiny little heal potion, or heal spell. Keep on going. I'm starting to realize this golem is not good. <laughs> I may need to upgrade him. Find a way to upgrade him. Oh no, I know what you're doing. You're trying to slow me down. So that when he comes, he can just destroy me. <laughs> well, Scream Kicker, bug squished. My pack is full. My pack is full. Another one of those. I'm going to hope they're optional. They may not be optional. But it always seems like it's more harm than good to go through them. I love to be getting more than one of these at once. But our mana is in trouble. <laughs> Fine, I'll waste some on you. That's my pet making that noise, right? That's not me. I hope I don't sound that wimpy. Huh? Huh? I just healed him. Well, don't know where my golem is. Pet seems to be uh, a little skittish and he's on the run. Oh, he's back. You know, that spell heal all four. Well, that's, I've, that's the one I've already got. It's funny, I was just talking about it. It, um... It doesn't take a lot of mana for the amount it heals, so it's like a pretty efficient spell. Especially since mana is so easy to get. Because if I really wanted to, I could just wait every time, and then I'd have enough. Where did those guys come from? Yeah, I don't know about you. I'm starting to get tired of these enemies. I want to see something new. I mean, yeah, they're tough. They pose a bit of a challenge, but... I don't know. It's a lot of the same right now. Tell me what you think. I'm not sure. Yeah, okay. So now we'll take a defensive position. And uh, compartmentalize one at a time. And make sure that attack does not hit me. Heal all. And now spawn kill these guys as they come in from the portal. Hi, welcome to the overworld. Death. Okay, I'm going to wait out a little bit so I can heal my pet. Looks like our golem disappeared. Bring back another one of them, even if it's not that good. He at least creates a line of defense, you know? Especially as I'm using a lot of ranged attacks. 
My mana is low. And my mana is destination screwed. So it's going to be a little uh, hand to hand combat while we replenish. Trying to feeling backs it up. I really wanted to give it to my pet, but surprise, you can't. Aha, you thought my mono was gone for good. Wow, another one of these portals. Okay. Oh, wait, what? Sometimes it does that where I try to cast a spell and it doesn't work. Maybe I just accidentally release the button or something. That time worked just fine. Alright, so my pet's starting to do better overall with health goes. Identified shoulders, huh? Speaking of health, though, might want to use some right there. I can't carry anymore. Really? I might as well use one then. Oh, is this a dead end? Oh, I went the wrong way. I see I came around the edge. Yeah, there we go. Okay, and I'm a little too close. Yeah, our uh, tactical approach to that was not great. No wonder my pet's fleeing. I'm overburdened. Ah, uh, yes. Well, good timing. Ah, uh, because we got a big boss coming up. I'm gonna wait three seconds for me to be able to use the spell again. Oops. Okay. And it's go time. So we're gonna try this move again. Close. I would prefer to be a ways away when it happens. You know, I'm not going to say that doesn't do a whole lot, but that doesn't do anything. Alright, I'm going to heal using a potion. Good heal again, good heal. Yeah, we're doing this the cheesy way. But it worked. So we can assign a skill point. Oh, surely I've got to have a beam golem. That's what my my helmet is. It's a beam golem. So can I have both? So I do six. Yes, I can. Cool. All right, let's see how good the beam golem is. Awesome. Yeah, that's going to be interesting. That's going to change our dynamic uh, as far as how fighting works. I like how it's ranged too, especially since I, so I tend to play. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I might as well use a potion. I've got 18 of them now. Quick, get out of the way. Death before the combo. Blast. This is why I hate flying. Okay, so make sure we're healed up. Uh, move around to the side. Do a three for dead, dead, dead. Skill sorry. Oh, yeah, and you. Dead. <laughs> ah, still got me. Didn't do much though. Oh, I see the stairs. I see the stairs. Let's not die before the stairs. Okay. 
range bow as opposed to unranged bow? I don't know. Um, I think I'm actually going to semi-pet the town. I don't think we need to go back there in person once we take out the trash. Um, so, uh, let's see. Got that new spell, send that over. And we'll identify everything we can. Fidian fingers. Hmm. This is a little I better. Can't do that. Oh, it requires level 28. Okay, so we'll sell it. Identify. Nowhere near as good. Um. Yeah, this is actually definitely better. So that we'll isn't possible. I need the strength. Okay. Never mind. Let's sell that. I can't do that. These are all ready. 435. I can't use it though. Mm. See, that's the problem. It's all these things I might want to use but can't. I can't do that. Okay. Well, I guess there's something we forgot. In more ways than one. Pet. Go to town. You've earned it. Stairs down. We've been in the Black Palace for a while. I wonder how long the section is. Okay, now. Oh, right into the... Two of these. They're both bosses? Oh, no. Okay, so they're not going to be affected by that. So we need to... Start uh, making something happen. They got grand health potions. Okay. Trouble, trouble trouble. The good thing is, if we need to, we can retreat up the stairs. I don't think these guys have any way to heal. And then maybe I would need to go to hell, to town, to uh, get a potion. Also, my golems are gone. Now, this is right where I want to be, though, is out of the way. That's why I was having troubles, because they're attacking me. Specifically, because I didn't have any line of defense. I'm going to keep using these potions, because I expect we're going to find a grand mana potion coming up. <laughs> I want to see what the eye for that is. It's just going to be massive. Alright, health for all. We're uh, getting close on both of them. Got to hang in there. One down. My mana is low. Come on. My mana and two low. down. Double kill. Let's check out this grand mana potion. I need it right now. Whew, that looks fancy. Oh, that really loads it up. Okay, beam golem's dead. What, what is this thing? Phase. Wait, what? It opens a phase portal of death. We've seen these guys before. Oh. That was an accident. I didn't want to go through it. Hey, a secret storage room. Bunch of stuff down there. Well, this might be a good thing after all. I'm gonna find a lot of cash. Oh yeah, that's right, there's spikes. You know what? The changing thing is nice. I wanna use the ballista. I always w tried to use it, but I could never be able to. You know, it's a nice little throwback. See some old enemies. Get pummeled by some spikes. Kill some zombies. What more could you want from life? Oh, it's the boss. Is this poison?
I'm gonna level up. I was just thinking about what I'm gonna use my next thing on. I'm gonna go back up mid magic. Just need to get that mana. And screw it. Let's um. Well, what's this? Sentry crystal. <laughs> Let's try it out. Why not? Nine. Okay, what does it do? All damage by 140%. Awesome. That's great. Does it include this damage? It says all damage. Okay, now we're in a tactically bad position, but these are lower level enemies, so I'm actually not worried. <laughs> like, look at that. There's no way I could have survived on that previous the floor we were on. Take care of these dwarves. Take care of myself. Oh yeah, you see that thing blasts when they do da attacks. I was attacking them. Oh, that's so cool. What a great thing. This crystal's awesome. I love this crystal. It's replenishing my HP and mana too. Oh no, sorry, that's my regular attack. Yeah, no wonder. Oh, he's dead. So these cracked ones not worth it. To kill this machine gun before it kills me. Get machined. My pack is full. I knew it was gonna be a mech. I thought the first one was gonna be, but it makes sense that the second one is. Can't click on the portal. There we go. So that was nice. We got some some cash and some gemstones. I remember where we were in this floor. So right now I'm just going to save these grand potions for when I really need it. Until I have enough to worth putting it in a quick slot, quick bar slot. I think until then I'm just wasting space. Especially since I'm more likely to be able to use one of these. But I do need space for it though, right? So we'll dump that. There we go. Okay, there's a lot going on here. Um, okay. So I think my uh, golems are gone. I just realized that. So I'll do this. Might as well... Yeah, I don't need it yet, actually. I need at least one to keep up with storage space. And the other thing is, when is my crystal going to disappear? This is a actually very high intensity fight. <laughs> Just gotta be careful. I'm overburdened. I'm overburdened. Ah, Sword Crusher the Accursed. Low, but I can still use it every once in a while, so we just keep on spamming it. My mana is low. And then he'll die eventually. Ah, so we still have giant health potions. So that's good to know. Those aren't going away. Holy enslaved Batman. Uh oh. Your pet is That was very close, but that was also really cool. That just blast. Man, who know Ma knew that mono would be such an issue? That's pretty much the reason I upgraded magic is because I wanted more mana. 
The thing is, using this attack once does a pretty big chunk of it. The thing is, it's not efficient against single enemies, uh, especially those... whatever they're called, enslaved. Sometimes I just gotta get done by hand, and that's the case right now. So we'll take these guys out. Pets fled, but I can heal him up. So he heals us. And we're back in the fight. No breaks. Yeah, I just need more range, like, oops, more knowledge at a distance to effectively use this one when it's single enemies. See, if not, you know, I just like getting that spot where, um, uh, I can't remember what I was saying, sorry. Kind of in the zone here. So, so our golems are gone. That's what was that was what was missing. I knew something was weird. And that's it. Man. All right, fine. I'll deal with the elemental on these dead. I kind of wanted to stay out of that fight, but... Okay, so this is a good time to use it. Like, way over here. My mana's low. Except for my mana's out. Why was I do I'm not thinking? Yeah, but then I gotta take out these three, so I'm forced to go back. Well, good time to heal him. Now, we'll use this attack. This is where I'd like to be. It's just, like, way out of the... In the distance. And just blasting him. Like, seriously, you can stand right here. Except for, make sure I don't get a pummel by the guys who are coming to me. But you see, I got enough of a head start on them that hopefully it'll be really easy to just take them out. Of course, when they just like run straight to you. So much for that plan. You know, it's one thing I haven't seen in this game yet? One-shot enemies. I am very thankful for that. That was a serious pain. Not in the traitor soul, but... Oh, we got something going on. You have slowed our plans, visitor. But Ordrak's time is endless. All we require now is a willing sacrifice. Once you are dealt with, I will retrieve Sil and complete the Dark Ember. Kneel or pet. Well, Aldrich wants to fight, so let's uh, heal ourselves up as best we can. I'm going to reset these guys. And my pet went right to him. Wait, what's going on? Is this part of the boss fight? Uh, I sure hope these guys don't just spawn. Like, <laughs> regenerating spawn. Whoa, okay. Something big's going on. So uh, Ulrich's <laughs> a, uh, how should I say, master in the dark arts. And I hate that he's summoning these guys. Hate that. But we'll deal with it. My pet's fleeing. Turn around, we can deal some shots in there. Whew, we gotta heal ourselves, heal our pet. Loop around. A potion on him. Yeah, his dragon can just take so long to kill, unfortunately. I don't like whatever he did there. Oh, 
Well, they go down pretty easily doing that. That's the positive, I suppose. How are we doing on Ulrich? All right, we're making some hits. We're getting some damage on him. Fallen Sage, indeed. Not sure I want to be that close to him. At least I use my uh, spell preemptively um, as a precaution. Okay. So we can cut through them to Ulrich. Oh, did he die? Oh, I guess he fled. Oh, and the enemies were suddenly gone. That was a pretty good deal. So we ran away on this portal. Ooh, and there's stairs down, but there's a way gate to town. And upon killing these extra enemies that are here for no reason, where are they? Is there like a little nook back there? Oh, there it is. Okay, I am not in any plans to die there. Anyway, what I was going to say is I want to go back to town. And then we'll sell our stuff. So we'll go to the... Well, this guy. I, I bet he sells the grand potions now, too. Oh, I guess not. I say all these things which I think are true, and they never are. Vital Diabolic Necklace. Um, 313. Still nothing better than the Geomancer. Oh, that was better, though. Should have kept it. Cold Ember, 12 ice damage. Fire Ember and Dull Skull. Yeah, I'm just going to sell it. That's not of high use to me right now. Sell these extra guys. Look at spells. Frost 6, Draining Touch. Heal self. Well, I'm not going to use that ever. Hmm. Alright, so... I guess that'll be in the end of the episode. This is Retro Gaming Now playing Torchlight, and we are making some progress. I'll see you guys in the next episode. Have a nice day.